Let's watch the Mr. Beast video. Let's watch it. Stop this train when a Lamborghini. Lambo sorry. Oh my god, I, I didn't do that right now. Stop this train to win a Lamborghini. I'm so cringe for that. Sitting on these train tracks is a quarter million dollar Lamborghini. And barreling down on it right now is a massive train. But Do you know that my favorite car brand is Lamborghini? The more you know. But before the impact, I'm giving this Lamborghini to Blake. Thank you. And on top of sending the train, no. I'm also <laughs> going to have these eight soldiers shoot 10,000 bullets at your Lamborghini. That's Ooh. the scariest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. It's gonna be fun. And you have exactly 24 okay. hours to build whatever you want to protect your Lamborghini from the bullets. The timer starts now. Okay, first line of defense, I'm thinking a wall of cinder blocks. Yeah. After that, some shipping containers. Isn't that all? I mean, if you if you are going to build a really thick wall, the bullets shouldn't penetrate that, right? Filled with refrigerators. And then basically just... Refrigi oh, he watched Indiana Jones. Yeah. <laughs> of cars to block those bullets do you think all of this is enough to stop 10,000 bullets i think it is jimmy okay but so far nothing's there you okay. should get the building blake immediately drove to three stores where i gave him my credit card and he literally spent seventy-eight thousand dollars. oh on my supplies. god and since i don't want to bore you with all that let's just skip to the part when everything was delivered his first round of supplies are starting to show up oh my god i can't believe i okay. bought all this stuff and this isn't even everything man he's got a water truck some of his junk cars came in he's got a connex crate over here how did he get this much stuff this is crazy when the refrigerators explode why would they explode you know i just remembered give me a second i just remembered one scene from indiana jones where he went inside a fridge this is what i remembered wow. he literally climbed inside a fridge to survive nuclear bomb it exploded and he fell from the sky if i remember yeah in the fridge And then, he was okay, nothing happened. If it can't destroy a fridge, yeah, my buddy, you can survive like that. Everything you see on the internet, it's true. Don't worry about the guys with the machine guns. Just pretend they're not there. Yeah. I don't <laughs> know what they're doing there, honestly. We're five hours in, and this storage container is about to be the first line of defense against 10,000 bullets. All right, that's probably good. That's probably good. Okay. Do you think that shipping container is going to stop any bullets? Absolutely not. No. Yeah. So as of now, he's screwed. Yeah, he's not looking good for him. Oh, gosh. It's been about six hours. Are you happy with your progress? I'm very happy. Yeah. You sure? What? It wasn't until this thing got down. <laughs> but now that it's down, dude, I feel really good. I asked them if this would stop the bullets, and they said no. And once Blake realized he had to go all out, he worked not only through the night. This way, Mr. Railroad ties. Nice, nice, yes. Really nice, really nice. But even into the next morning, upgrading his defense. Dude, he's stuffing the storage container with a van and a giant tube. And once I saw it put together, I was honestly pretty impressed. Run me through what you built. So I built a whole bunch of concrete in the front. And the tallest okay. part of the wall is right in the yeah. center to block the crow's nest machine guns because those things are big and scary. I got all my storage containers and a bunch of water. And if you come right over here, you will see his Lamborghini tucked away amongst everything. That is a good idea. Everything that he did. If I remember correctly, he already was in some videos. Right? In Mr. Beast videos. There it is, nice and cozy. Do you think all of this he looks the will same. stop the bullets? Yeah, I do. I think you have a 50% chance of survival. What's the best odds I've had yet, so. And I before think I have them shoot 10,000 rounds, I come think with me to the Lamborghini. He Not will. only are you competing for this Lamborghini, but for 100 I think grand he will. as well. What? Oh. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? This will be enough to cover the insurance. <laughs> so 450 hours is out, or 350,000? Something like that. Bullets versus everything that Blake has built. Are you ready? Just get it over with. Freaking out. It's Lamborghini who are can by the way. I'm correct. Sir, fire at will. Roger that. Stand by! Fire! Seems like it. On his oh my god. god. Make them stop. Make them stop. Uh, they're actually ripping through the cinder box now. Okay. Oh, Wait. Man. Oh god. Yo, Blake's walls are crumbling. I mean, as I said. And what we haven't told Blake is these guys. If he would just build a wall, we need to build a wall. And Mexico is going to pay for it. These are only um. the first of four phases we've designed to destroy this Lamborghini. Or should I say, whatever remains after this. They just brought out the LMG. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. 
I definitely wouldn't say that. Today here on the stream. I'm glad that you can. All it takes is one bullet to penetrate, and it's going in his Lambo. Oh my god! I don't think it will penetrate. Is it the last bullet? It's okay. Oh God. I think it's safe. okay. How is it? She's yeah. Clean, baby. Yeah. Woo! Lucky. I don't think so. No bullet holes in your you just need a wow. You don't already know who Blake is. He's actually a contestant yeah. for two previous videos. But today yeah. he's back for a third and final attempt. He already lost twice on Mr. Beast's channel. <sighs> Unlucky, unlucky. To win the grand prize. Are you ready for phase two? Yes. See that giant crane coming? That big yellow oil rig looking thing? That is phase two. That crane is going to lift your car up 100 feet and then in 24 hours drop it and you have to catch it without it being destroyed. What? That's impossible. That is impossible. Yeah, like your car is going to destroy, like geometry of the car is going to get destroyed either way. Seriously? Yeah. All right, bring it over here. And while we prepare the just put the cinder blocks all up to the hook, man, that's a good idea. That is a really good idea. Yeah, because the car is going to get destroyed even if you stop it, because it's going to like it's not going to be symmetrical after that. The world's first hundred foot Lamborghini freefall. There goes your Lamborghini, Blake. Blake began to strategize on how he was going to catch it. I have no Man. idea what I'm gonna do. Chandler, come over here. Yes, I'm here. How would you break its fall? So you get all the pillows in the city. Okay. Step two, okay. get all the mattresses. No. Next, no. get a blanket. Chandler, you're just making a giant bed. Then a warm glass of milk. <laughs> all right, stop, you're not helping. Blake, work your magic. Oh, I'm screwed. <laughs> all right, guys, I got some good news and bad news. We passed day one with flying colors. The bad news is uh, the Lamborghini is airborne. Okay. <laughs> so, anyone got any ideas? I mean, uh, yeah, I mean, like, what do we think? Tina had a good idea. Castles. Bouncy castles. That, that's actually not that bad, just because that's not bad at all, really. And after being inspired by the construction worker's wisdom, Blake had decided on his master plan. I would like to move the connexes in like a square right here with the X in the middle, and that way I can just okay. fill the square up with a bunch of air mattresses, pillows, mm. bubble wrap, and I'll top it all off with a bunch that's, of bouncy that castles. Is, that is, you know, definitely the biggest problem right now is I have no materials everything that i bought is hard concrete or metal and nothing that, that I is two ton of a car bouncy castle so really yeah that is definitely going to break but maybe not because we are only in five minutes from 18 minute video uh, i can use for so i have absolutely nothing and so blake sent his crew to buy every pillow maybe and not, air actually. mattress in the city and even though he was incredibly sleep deprived he got to work i'm already at the stage where it's like wait why am i doing this again oh yeah that's right i'm in a challenge for a lamborghini that's floating in the sky right now by the time okay. his materials had arrived blake had been yeah. awake for over 24 hours and was in desperate need of sleep i'm gonna try to get some sleep because i'm exhausted and it's four in the morning and with how exhausted blake was he ended up what? sleeping for wait because i'm exhausted and what? it's four why is it blasting on him? <laughs> well, with how sleep. exhausted Blake was, he ended up sleeping for way longer than he planned. Blake! Um, is he serious? Oh, what is this? <laughs> he got mattresses, pillows, and blankets. Yeah, that is not going enough. to stop it. Yeah, that's the key to everything. <laughs> Where is Blake? He's asleep, I heard. No, he's not. Yeah. By the time Blake got on site, he was nah. already super late in the day. Nah. That's Blake's truck pulling nah, up. Man. Right, we need to get to work, come on. All right, let's just see what this looks like. Oh, that bouncy house works as a big box. So I'm thinking maybe we put that thing in the middle now and then we start blowing it up. Only four and a half hours remain and it's not looking good for Blake. I don't think he has more than a 10% chance of catching that Lamborghini. And even if he does, there's no shot he's stopping that train later on. Yeah. They're filling up the side so that way it's high over here takes away this wall. So with only a couple of hours remaining, Blake did all that he could by filling the rest of his pit with cardboard boxes and bubble wrap. It's coming down to the wire. Chandler, Man. how much time is left? This seems like a joke. You know, trying One to hour. stop a Lamborghini from Blake falling. I have a little bit of bubble wrap left. I think I'm just gonna get raised on this thing and just wrap my baby up in this bubble wrap and I'm good to go. That's definitely gonna help. Blake spent what little time he had remaining on this crane, failing <laughs> at trying to bubble wrap his car. It's just not gonna work. You know what time it is? What? Time to drop the car. Let's drop this bad boy. The 
failed bubble wrap makes it look majestic. Mm, like, yeah. you think your Lamborghini will survive? I'm positive, Jimmy. He's more certain than me. <laughs> I'm positive about this one. I bought every air I'm mattress not. at Walmart. If this won't catch it, I don't know what I'm will. Not. I did everything I can. Here's a few swills bar, Blake. Oh, thank you, Mr. You know, that way, okay. even if you lose the car, at least you have some good chocolate. It's available in Walmart. Be sure to go. I swear to God, if it works, yeah. Try our new chocolate bar. I'm so curious what you think. But anyways, you. I saw a video. Chat. I saw a video of a guy who made this. Who made this? At work. Advertisement. Chocolate. It's available in Walmart. Be sure to go try our new chocolate bar. I'm so curious what it's you really think. Cool. But anyways, you have three bouncy castles, I saw how he did mattresses, it. how many pillows? 150. 150 pillows and 2,000 cardboard boxes. Will it break the Lamborghini's fall? Yeah. Yes. Yes. That's Wait, curious. no. Okay. 24 hours of work I, down no. to this. No pun intended. It will break three, the Lamborghini. Two, one, drop the Lamborghini. Let's analyze, chat. Let's analyze. <laughs> I mean, it survived probably, like, it's drivable. But it firstly fell on back wheels and then on front wheels. So the car, the car is not going to be like straight like this. It's gonna be like this, you know? Because it fell on back wheels first, so it's going to be curved. I'm so sorry. Please be okay, please be okay, please be okay, please be okay. Alright, he's moving the counter straight out the way. There's no way you got that Lambo. Get these boxes out of the way. Oh. What? We're about to find out how damaged this car is. The lights work. Ooh. The lights work? Yeah, this princess castle might have saved this entire car. <laughs> Moment of truth. You might have been the first person in history to catch a Lamborghini. If it turns on. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. That is crazy. Everything looks good, minus a little crack in the bumper. <laughs> little crack. Bro, that's like $25,000 damage. On Lamborghini? Which we found out by this official appraiser, this was only going to reduce the price of Blake's Lamborghini by- Probably 10 grand. Thank you so much. Nah. Nah. <laughs> $20,000. I was right. <sighs> Thanks for the good news. And now it's the perfect time to mention that phase three is flaming cars. For Blake's next challenge, oh. we're bringing back his... Oh, I remember this. I remember this. He failed on this one. Biggest nightmare. We have... Wait, did Mr. Beast just... Flaming cars. Does he have... 11 subscribers in the graphics? For Blake's next challenge, we're bringing back his biggest nightmare. We have... 1 trillion subscribers, sorry. Can, can we can, can we stop for a second? Why does he have right down here one trillion subscribers? For Blake's next challenge, we're bringing back his biggest nightmare. Just we look. have recreated one the trillion? flaming cars challenge <laughs> that cost Blake everything last time. Wow. That's a low blow. That is but crazy. But seeing how he's done this before, we're going to up the stakes by dropping twice as many cars as last time. Whew. I'll see you tomorrow. I got a lot to prove. Redemption day. Blake spent the re I remember that he put wood. <laughs> next to the car, so that's why it failed. Rest of the last night, time. disassembling his defense for phase two. And after Is a he going to do it sleep, again? He was ready to begin his defense. Yeah, he for put phase the word. Three. Three in the exactly. morning, just woke up. We got a lot of work to do today, so let's get started. Here's the day three plan. I'm gonna cut the bottom out of a shipping container and I'm gonna drop it right on the car. Next, I'm gonna take. <laughs> what an idiot. Two more containers, and I'm gonna lean them up, coming to a point right above the car. And most importantly, nothing flammable this time. Do you think that will yeah. deflect the car? Yes, sir. Oh, I thought nothing you were gonna say no. <laughs> Blake then asked his crew to remove every piece of wood that was in the container, because that's what ended his challenge last There is wood inside containers? Oh, I guess... I guess on the bottom, yeah, okay. This time. He then had them cut out the bottom of the container that would surround the Lamborghini. The storage container could put a lot of damage. Completely crush it? Yeah. It can? I mean, yeah, I think it weighs a whole lot. And with that being done, Blake just needs to lower the container carefully over the Lamborghini without damage. Why didn't they just drive inside a container? 
Jenny. One scratch could cost them thousands of dollars. You're good, just like that. It is so close to scraping the car. What? Maybe he can't use the car. Yeah, that's that's that is maybe possible. Your fingers were coming down. Yes! I yes! cannot believe that. All right, next we're gonna bring these containers together to form a V. What if the car gets caught in there? Yeah, that's that can't happen, dude. That's why we're putting this pointy thing at the top. Do you think that will actually deflect their car? 100%. 20 minutes remain, and then we see if that. <laughs> that is not going to hold. A car falling on it? Nah, man. Lamborghini perishes just like his 500 grand. And as usual, Blake utilized every last second. Three, two, one. Not quite sure what that dirt accomplished. <laughs> time is up. No. Let's see if, unlike last that time. Is <laughs> Sorry, Chad, but this is another kind of hole. Like, <laughs> what? A car falling on it? Like last time, you survived phase three. Redemption! Like, you lost $500,000 from this exact challenge. How are you feeling? I feel pretty confident. I think the viewers want to know one thing. Did you put wood inside of there like last time? A little bit. No, I'm just kidding. There's no wood in there. It was one of the biggest mistakes I've ever made in my life. Moment yeah. of truth. Come on Ooh. in. Three shipping containers, a bunch of dirt, concrete, a weird like pointed roof thing versus 10 <laughs> flaming cars. Are you ready? Let's go, dude. Light it on fire. Will Blake be one step closer to going home with a brand new Lamborghini? Filled with $100,000 or be eliminated and go home with nothing. We're about to find out. Three, two, two one. one. Drop it! Oh! <laughs> oh, it broke immediately, chat. <laughs> it broke immediately. Oh, oh. The thing broke immediately. Oh, you did not I want feel that like that's too. exactly what he didn't want to happen. Oh, no. Man. You still feeling good? Not as good. Yeah, this is giving me some flashbacks. It's giving you some flashbacks. All right. Ready for the next one? Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Drop it. You literally it. broke the first time. Oh, my God. The roof yeah, is already buckling. Oh. And just in case Blake loses to the flaming cars like last time, I'm gonna take this moment and tell you about this amazing new phone. What you're currently watching on is the new Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. Ooh. This phone can record slow-mo and 4K. The camera on this is crazy. We're like 200 feet away and it's nighttime and look at how crystal clear it is. <laughs> and go ahead and drop it. Oh! Oh, that hurt to watch. It also has a ton of new features with Galaxy AI, like photo assist. Remember the last challenge when the bumper got cracked on the Lambo? You can just circle it like this, and then all you do is you hit that eraser button, and just like that, the bumper is fixed. Now I have a new car. For the picture, you do. Whatever you're ready. He ain't getting it. This phone also has circle to search with Google, which makes finding information incredibly easy. It would have helped Blake a lot in the last video to learn about the flammability of wood and railroad ties. Yeah. All he needed to do was long press the home button, circle the railroad ties, and ask, is this flammable? As you can see, railroad ties are flammable. He would have learned the answers instantly. I could have just told you. Bam. I was genuinely impressed by this I mean, phone, it and I think like you will to be work. too. So, go to Samsung.com, click the link in the description, or scan this QR code because to check is, it out right now. There and isn't a web this time. That's why. We drop car after car, and with each one, we could tell Blake was getting nervous. But we also noticed that all of the oh. impacts were starting to damage the crate itself. Oh. Your crate on the bottom is bowing. At this point, the container protecting the Lamborghini was being crushed by the weight and oh. heat of the cars. What about this every day since the last time I saw this? And now it's time for the final car! Yes! Fall! Uh, fall! Oh, oh, oh no! Bro, it's gotta be a thousand degrees in there. His car has to be melting now. We got the fire extinguisher. Somehow he's running so fast. Be careful, Blake! I'm coming! How is it? It's okay! It's okay! No! Oh my god, that's like that. really close. If one more car was it actually has more space than before. <laughs> but one, maybe one, two more cars, yeah, and it would be 
Kaput. This crate would have collapsed. You stopped 10,000 bullets. Easy. You lucky guy, yeah, exactly. Well, he failed two times already, but yeah, lucky guy. You know, deflect but how to stop train? Yeah, that's the question that we are asking from 2011 when GTA came out. GTA 5. Cars, and now it's time for phase four. Bring on the train. And that is the, the exact train, by the way. Started. I think. Good luck it seems on phase like it. Four. Godspeed. What is he even running at? Blake knew that the train was going to be the most deadly attack yet, so he wasted no time in getting started. I think the best way to stop a train is to derail it. That's yeah. Yeah. But this is a real life, so you can derail it. How much distance does the train have? I don't know. We will see probably. Well, to build it here. All these railroad ties are tucked. It seems snug, like pretty far. All of these are gonna go under the train. The train's gonna hit them like that. And if I do that a hundred more times, I don't see the train just blowing past all that. The railroad ties lost me the challenge yeah. last. I think you can derail a train really easily in real life in GTA, <laughs> but in real life, I think. That is not actually that hard. The cars were probably harder. This video, this time they'll save me. Just need two inches off the track and I win. Two inches is a lot though. My man. And then once I have all this done, I can just put concrete on top. I think that's gonna work, man. I think that's gonna work. Lake worked with his crew throughout the can entire Can he just break night. the rails? And when I showed up the next... Mm, I don't think so. I think Mr. Beast... Like, set some rules, you know? This morning, it was obvious that the challenge had taken a toll on him. What's up, Jimbo? What happened to your Jimbo. voice? I'm like dying out here. As you guys know, he lost two hundred fifty thousand dollars in this video. He lost half. Why? Wait, I'm, like I'm so. Here. As you guys know, he lost two hundred fifty. Now, if you look down there, on the left side of the screen, you can see that Mr. Beast has nine hundred ninety-nine million subscribers. Why this time not trillion? Fifty thousand dollars in this video. He lost half a million dollars in this video. I think Blake is sick and tired of losing. He has an army going super hard. I'm They're really confused. The cars that we dropped on phase three on the train tracks. But time was still ticking down, and in order to stop this train and take his Lambo home, Blake began adding a lot more yeah, objects that's... to the tracks, like no. shipping containers, mattresses to cushion the impact. Blake's worked so hard. I'm now on his team. And water tanks. Blake really seems to know what he's doing. Too bad there's only 11 minutes left. At this point, Blake did everything yeah, he could. the train could is not going to hit the car. To finish his build before time ran out. Nah. And it was actually starting to look impressive. This is it. Three. The final stretch. Two. One. Last line of defense. Time's up. Stop. Turn it off. Turn it off. Time is officially up. Oh my god. From phase one's shipping containers, phase two's mattresses, and even phase three's burning cars, you somehow use all the resources from the previous phases. Let's see if you're driving home in a Lamborghini or if I'm dropping you off at your house. Bring that train on, man. Bring it on. Before we ram everything, we need to back the train up. We're going to go really far oh. back. That way oh. the train can pick up a lot. Can he put the track on the rails and put the dummy inside to press gas? You are asking the wrong person. You are asking the wrong person. A lot of speed before it hits everything. Sound like a good idea? No, Jimmy, that sounds awful. Be honest, do you think your Lamborghini will survive? God, I hope so, Jimmy. And of course, we had to put the Feastables logo on the train. The new formula is the best chocolate on earth. Do yourself a favor and go give it a try. But for now, it's time I for can't. the biggest moment of Blake's life. Let's see oh, if he wins a Lamborghini. 1,000 feet. Any last words? Give it all you got. Send the train. Here it comes. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. It's coming! It's gonna speed up until it hits 35 miles an hour right before impact. That is not that fast. I thought it's going to go faster than 35 miles an hour. Dude, it is going quick. It's just gonna derail. It's just gonna derail. Here she comes! Let's see if it was all worth it. Okay. Is it stopping? It seems like it's derailed. Yeah. It stopped! Oh! Yeah. Wait! 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 What? There ain't no festivals in Croatia, unfortunately, yeah. Wait, wait, I think also, not in Slovakia, oh so... My god. Unfortunately. Wait, I've never seen oh, time. My god. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, I did it! Oh! Oh, yes. oh my god. This is your new Lamborghini, Blake! 
Not only did he win the Lamborghini, but he also got all this money. Yes! Congrats! I did it! You wanna know the he best did way it. to end this video, Blake? What? Well, I've been going to Walmart and buying Feast of right now. It's the best tasting chocolate on the planet. Third time's the charm. See you guys later. Yes! He did it! Derby six thousand. Oh, he finally did it! Finally, after the third time, he did it.